Why is my LED TV black and white? Are you sure you aren't stuck on one of those old movie channels? The old shows I'm watching aren't that old. Check the video cables. That's especially true if the TV is showing black and white images and a messed up video image. It is crisp and clear, just minus the color. I think the cause then is that it thinks it is receiving a component video signal, though you're sending it a composite signal. How do you fix that? If your TV supports baseline analog video as well as digital video and it thinks it is getting baseline analog, go into the TV menu to switch it. I've never been anywhere near those settings. That doesn't mean someone didn't accidentally flip it trying to reprogram the TV or a software update messed it up. That would be only slightly better than software updates where it gives you a black screen until you reboot. Oh, you can try rebooting too. I'm worried that it is a hardware problem. If you plugged in a cable to the green Y input instead of the green, blue and red video cables needed for composite signals, it is a hardware problem. Fortunately, it is fixed by switching around the AV cables. How should I connect the cables? The red and white cable should be plugged into the first two inputs on the back of the TV for most models, though you always want to check the manual for your particular model. If I had the manual, I'd know where in the menu to check for black and white TV settings. Then know that the PB, PR, and Y jacks are the component ones, and if you've got cables connected to those, it could explain why you have the black and white image. I'd like something I can do and likely fix. Something I know you could do rather simply is make sure the input source is set to Avenue, and if you're getting black and white images from the DVD player, make sure it is set to Output Avenue instead of Component. Why would someone tell it to put out a composite signal? Because they are using an RCA cable for audio and composite signal for video to a composite port. Those are the blue, green and red ports on the TV, I think. This is why there are geeks who make a living connecting cables between smart devices. But know that you can get the black and white image if the blue jack on the TV isn't connected to the blue jack on the video source. Actually, that isn't too hard to do. But if making sure the settings are right and cables are properly connected, you're down to a bad display board or TV screen. If the screen was bad, I'd expect it to be all black, not black and white. There's always the default of setting the TV to factory settings, just in case someone trying to optimize the color scheme on the TV was an utter failure. And I'll feel like less of an idiot calling for service after checking that.